हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई होप यू आर डूइंग गुड एंड माय वीडियोस आर एक्चुअली हेल्पफुल फॉर यू यू आर रियली एंजॉइंग देम प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू कवर वन वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग फंक्शन फ्रॉम ओरेकल सो कैन यू गिव मी द आंसर ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन सपोज इफ आई गिव यू वन टेबल नेम एंड द स्पेलिंग इज इन करेक्ट सो लाइक फॉर जेंडर जी ई एन डी ई आर इफ आई टेल यू जी एन डी आर ओनली राइट सो कैन यू टेल मी द एग्जैक्ट एंड करेक्ट टेबल नेम by finding uh, in oracle database so let's see how it can be done so let's write down so let's start from employees hmm? so this is giving you the result but what if i write employee so this is saying that table or view does not exist so see what happens basically till uh, 11g default table name in oracle was employee and then it has been changed to employees in telsi so let us write down let us try to find out the correct table name okay so let us start from all tables where table name equal to employee so you are getting the uh, no output over here so you don't know the correct suppose you don't know the correct table name what you are going to do you you can use the like operator as well but then there is very uh, important function that is known as sound x okay sound x so this can also help you out for the profiling purpose so let me uh, give you the example how so over here i will write it down sound x of the table name equal to sound x of this table okay wow so now you are able to see the answer so you can say okay but this can also this can be also achieved by using like parameter right like uh, operator that is fine i agree with that but what if i write down like this one mm. okay let me write this query first with uh, like as well select a star from all tables where table name like and then emp employee okay perfect so this is giving the uh, correct table name that is fine now let us change something over here let us remove this o okay so this sound x function is still giving you the result but if we remove this o from like operator then you are not going to get any result okay why see when you are using like operator like actually picks the particular uh, value so this value and then this will uh, then like will start looking for this value in whole string of all table name column but soundex work differently soundex basically creates one sound like the pronunciation whatever value you are get, uh, giving and then it matches that pronunciation with the table names so that is why even if you omit something over here you are going to get the result so let me give one more example by creating one more table that is create table uh, gender hmm? name where care to okay so in this in this table we will see how we can find out the correct table name so if i write gender over here okay and gender over here, over here so oracle can give me the correct table name so that is fine but if i remove e from here then also oracle is able to give me the correct table name if i remove e from here as well then also if you see oracle is uh, able to give me the correct table name so g n d r if i use this in uh, like parameter or like sorry operator you are not going to get any result what does it mean it means that soundex function can give you all such table names which sounds like gender where this is useful this is use very useful for profiling purpose how suppose there are two tables right one is gender code and one is gender description for all codes you have a description in the gender description table but the spelling names are different at one side you are having g e n d e r underscore c d but the other side the other table that is g n d e r underscore description you have only code table how you are going to find out the description table simply without if uh, anyone does not tell you you are not able to find it out by using like operator right but this soundex operator can be very useful to find that thing so for business analyst 
this is really very useful because you are involved in day-to-day -day profiling work and this can be also helpful for finding out the correct column names as well so there is a data dictionary right all tab calls and all so you can also find the correct column names so i hope this is going to be very useful for you try uh, with this with some examples right and then let me know in case if you have any queries or questions so guys thank you thank you so much for watching this video